everybody. Do you have an old Ford? Do you ever run into a problem where you turn the key and no matter how many times you turn it, this is all you get? Well then stay tuned because I'm going to teach you how to start your old Ford with a screwdriver. Now, this is meant to be only in emergency situations. You don't just do this, don't be doing this all the time for a week. But, the first thing you do is just grab a regular, long, flat screwdriver. Next thing you need to do is make sure your key is all the way forward. Okay. Then, the next step in all of this is you walk up to the corner. This, my friends, is called a starter solenoid. Okay, this is the power wire. And this, this little hideous one, this one runs down to the starter. What you want to do is you want to make continuity between those two terminals by touching them both together. Now be careful folks, it will spark. Now that is not something that you should do all the time. But it will work, and if that does work, this is your problem. This is what's wrong. Everything else is working if that just worked. So your problem will be the starter solenoid. Now nowadays, on cars now, that won't work because the solenoid is built into the starter and then you have to replace it all. But if you drive an old Ford like this one, you're in luck because you just jump it up with the screwdriver. But don't worry if it is bad. One of these are only 10 bucks. Please just replace it and don't use my tip to go a week without changing it. So there's a little quick tip. Thank you for watching. Please rate and subscribe.